And here's someone else who has been the subject of Donald Trump's tweets. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. He's been trending for days now. There's intense speculation over his health. Is he alive or dead? No one can say for sure. He has not been seen in public since the 11th of April. He also missed the celebrations of his grandfather's birth anniversary on the 15th of this month. This is a very big event in North Korea. There are rumors that Kim may be dead or in a vegetative state. Is there any merit to these claims and reports? This report explores. Is Kim Jong-un dead? There is worldwide speculation over the North Korean dictator's health. Some say it's a heart surgery gone wrong. Others say it's the coronavirus. Some say the leader is alive and healthy. But nobody is saying where he is. China says it has no information. I have no information to provide about your specific question. South Korea has rubbish reports of Kim's death. Our government has enough information gathering capabilities to say confidently that there is nothing unusual. In the United States, Senator Lindsey Graham said he would be shocked if Kim is not dead or incapacitated. Guess what North Korea has to say? Nothing. North Korean state TV relayed a message from Kim Jong-un. Respected Supreme Leader Kim Jong-un has sent this thanks to the workers and officials at the construction site of the Wonsan Kalma Tourist Resort. He is thanking construction workers. Kim Jong-un did not show up for his grandfather's birth anniversary. The biggest event in the North Korean calendar. But he took time out to thank construction workers. The cover-up is poor. Adding to the speculation are two reports. One features Kim Jong-un's train, reportedly spotted at the North Korean resort town of Wonsan. What's the train doing here? Who was it ferrying? And the second is about a Chinese medical team visiting North Korea. If all is well with Kim, then what are the Chinese doctors doing in North Korea? Well, my guess is since we haven't heard anything from the North Koreans and the pressure has been building, there's been media discussion of this now for several weeks or like, what, 10 days. My guess is there's probably something wrong with him, um, you know, whether he's dead or incapacitated or a coma. I mean, there's a lot of stuff out there in the rumor mill. But at this point, given how much talk there's been and how quiet both North Korea and China have been, my guess is there's probably something wrong with his health, which wouldn't be surprising, right? I mean, he's morbidly obese, he smokes, um, he's had gout in the past. The mystery around Kim Jong-un is not surprising. Remember, North Korea is among one of the world's most secretive societies. There are no confirmed reports on Kim's age or how many children he has. The cult of personality is a carefully crafted one, pushed by constant good press. The dictator is projected as a hero, one riding a steed through knee-high virgin snow. His destination, Mount Pektu, the country's most sacred mountain. What is projected to the world is the image of a charismatic leader surrounded by a group of female soldiers. Every image, every visual, every new story involving Kim Jong-un is infused with messaging and glazed with propaganda. The man defines mystery and unpredictability. No one knows where he is right now or in what state. Bureau Report Vion World is One.